With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. The given question says that in figure AB is a code of the circle. So AB is a code of the circle, and AOC AOC is its diameter. So AOC is the diameter such that angle ACB is equal to 50 degrees. So we are given the measure of angle ACB that is 50 degree. If AT AT that is this ray is a tangent to the circle at the point A. So at point A AT is tangent. Now we are asked to find out the measure of angle BAT. Angle BAT means angle BAT means this angle. We are supposed to find out the measure of this angle. What is the measure of this angle? Option 1 says that 45 degree. Option 2 says that 60 degree. Option 3 says that 50 degree. Option 4 says that 55 degree. Now, if we consider this triangle that is B B A C triangle B A C then angle A B C is actually angle in a semicircle because A O C is diameter. Therefore, angle A B C will be equal to 90 degree because angle in a semicircle is 90 degree as AOC is a diameter. So angle in a semicircle is 90 degree. As AOC is diameter, therefore this is a semicircle and angle ABC will be 90 degree. So now we have angle ABC is equal to 90 degree. So from here we can find out the value of angle BAC. So if we observe triangle BAC or ABC, so in triangle ABC, the sum of all the three angles of triangle ABC will be 180 degree. This is what angle sum property of the triangle says. So we can write that the sum of angle ACB plus angle CBA plus angle CAB of the triangle ABC will be equal to 180 degree. This is what angle sum property of the triangle says. Angle sum property of triangle that all the three angles of the triangle, sum of all the three angles of the triangle is 180 degree. So from here we are going to find out the value of angle CAB. Now, putting in the values of angle ACB, angle ACB is 50 degree, angle ACB is 50 degree, angle CBA is 90 degree. So, put in the values, we will get 50 degree plus 90 degree plus angle CAB is equal to 180 degree. So, this will give us 140 degree plus angle CAB is equal to 180 degree. Angle CAB will be equal to 180 degree minus 140 degree which will give us angle CAB is equals to 40 degree. Now let's name this as equation 1. We will use it later on. Now we know that AT is tangent and OA is the radius of the circle because AOC is diameter so OA is radius. Now we know that when in a circle, suppose this is the circle, a tangent is drawn. A tangent is drawn to the circle. Uh, this is the tangent and this is the center and from from the center if we draw a radius suppose this is the center suppose this is the center of the circle and from the center let us call it a this uh, distance will be the radius and this is the tangent then the angle between tangent and the radius will always be 90 degree so we can say that in our case in the given question angle c a t will be 90 degree because the tangent and the radius will make the an angle of 90 degree. So angle CAT will be 90 degree or we can write angle OAT is equal to 90 degree. So angle OAT angle OAT is equal to 90 degree. Now angle OAT is what? Angle OAT is the sum of angle BAC or we can say angle BAO plus angle BAT. Angle BA O plus angle B A T is equals to 90 degree. Angle B A angle B A O is nothing but angle B A C which we have found out in 1 that angle C A B is equals to 40 degrees. So we can use it. So using 1 
we can write angle B A C. B A C is equal to 40 degree. So we can write this as 40 degree plus angle B A T is equal to 90 degree. This will give us angle B A T is equal to 90 degree minus 40 degree, which will be equal to 50 degree. So this is the measure of angle B A T. Angle B A T is equal to 50 degree. Let's go to the options. Option 1 says that 45 degree, which is not correct. Option 2 says that 60 degree, which is not correct. Option 3 says that 50 degree. This is the correct option in our answer to this question. Option 4 is 55 degree, which is also not correct. That's all. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITJ and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.